Hey guys, just wanted to make a short clip and say I apologize if any of my other clips seem like weird and forced. I'm still trying to get back into the in the mix of things and um, also streaming at the same time uh, and I'm kind of an awkward guy. So yeah, sorry about that. Definitely happy getting that uh, that extra roll of a lot of gold. It's a great way to uh, you know finish off the daily. I see that was something I should have recorded. 700 total level milestone from the Grand Tree. Pretty nice. And uh, big range level. 11 XP off of 37 too. Nice. And there we go. 100 quest points accomplished. And uh, prayer level. It's nice. Well, there was a grueling wait there at the end to restore all my stats. But uh, there's the body body. And there's all three of those quests knocked out. Back to back to back. Glad it gave me some coal back and uh, book of knowledge. Yeah, so while we wait, let's go over here. Maybe I can claim some rewards. Nice. That'll be uh, some gold, I think. Let's see. 250. Oh, man. That's... That's so good. Like, I'm only 700 total and I'm getting, you know, like a mil from this? It's crazy. And a highwayman mask, huh? Alright, add those to the pouch. First mil on the account. That's, uh, that's pretty nice. Just did the, uh, quick grind to 30 thieving. Got a gift offering. Pop that open. Uh, it's a shame that it's not the, um... Uh, that's not the onyx, but 60k is still nice. 74 gold charms is pretty useful, and I might need that for a quest or something. Uh, I remember my uh, my first run through of Iron Man mode and doing recordings every single time I completed a quest, making a clip for that. And man, now I'm just burning through them up to 113 quest points, and I've only shown off like four quest completions or something. <laughs> it's so weird. All right, and that extreme pain of a quest is now done. The giant dwarf really got sick of all that running around, but I uh, suppose I should re read the meeting notes and throw those out. And uh, yeah, got a few important levels in. Nice. And I'm really getting sick of cash below 45, so there it is. Finally. I was like 300 XP off, so I traveled all the way here just to... Yeah, do a little bit of manual divination. And, you know, I I don't know why uh, Polnivnich is called Polnivnich. It should be called, like, Ali... Ali? Yeah. That would make a little bit more sense. Anyway, there's the feud done. Thank you. 15,000 thieving. Six thieving levels. Only took four kills here to get the silver or the uh, mithril bar I need for in aid of the Myrek, so that's really good. All right, just turned in my uh, first daily challenge. That was the first challenge I got. It was a uh, combat one, so pretty meh. But I'll put it into attack because I dislike training melee the most. And um, yeah, sure, forty-two. And there's a hundred twenty-five quest points. From uh, freeing the Mountain Dwarf. That means uh, just 25 more quest points till I get that tier 75 weapon, but can't even equip it. Nowhere close to that. Just getting the 22 cooking requirement out of the way for a forgettable tale of a drunken dwarf. And yeah, 800 total level. Nice. I love those quests that just double your XP in a skill. So I had... Uh, yeah, I had 10k farming, now I have 15k. Had 6k cooking, and now I have 11k. Hey, at first it was up to 11k. Now it's up to 18k cooking. There's uh, Evil Dave Freed. Ah, those levels are really nice. Well, actually playing through my guide is showing that uh, I made a number of mistakes. Oh, well, okay, not too many mistakes, I guess, but like... Big one right now is that I didn't know I needed uh, 30 herb lore to start the Evil Dave quest. I must have uh, missed that requirement. So I gotta pick up uh, 30 herb lore from 23. 
Got some penguin points. I have some stuff in the bank. Uh, it should be pretty easy, but it's still kind of a pain. So yeah, basically just run around to all of your uh, penguin points. I have 11 right now, because I've gotten 6 this week. I had 5 from the uh, previous weekly reset, which happened uh, just a few hours ago. Bam! Herbalor XP. Straight to 31. So, yeah, no problem at all. Now I can do uh, Evil Dave's big day out. Whoa, there, emergency pocket sand? Yeah, that's pretty valuable stuff. You gotta keep that in a safe storage at the bank. So uh, that was my first time doing Evil Dave's big day out, seeing as I was gone for a while, and it doesn't take that long, has basically no requirements, and the rewards are insane. Nine magic levels, 39 to 48, but eight herblore levels, uh, oh, combat level 50 milestone, straight to 54 actually. Uh, let's see, how many? Seven agility levels, and yeah, eight cooking levels. Sure, that's just, wow. My overall XP just gained like 20% on itself. That's absurd. So I've been working on Garden of Tranquility for what feels like ages. Uh, probably actually two hours because I like babysitted all of the uh, the different farming patches that you have to do and I finally got everything planted in the garden um, doing my agility daily challenge and uh, let's turn that in it was werewolf skull ball so nice 43 agility all right so this will be the last thing I do on day three bam haunted mind done 22k strength XP lamp Nice four levels, and uh, yeah, 877 total, 140 quest points. Alright, so yeah, that's one of the um, worst quests in the game, now taken care of, and boom, two lamps, straight into farming, bam, and bam. Nice, so uh, 37 to 42 farming. Most of the way to 54 now. Right, so after all that uh, struggling in Dimension of Disaster, I can now buy this whole thing. Bam. Yep, all 150 points. So I got tier 25 hybrid gear. I can claim two more of these die. Nice. So that means that in under two days of playtime, I have passed a million overall XP from a fresh account. Feeling pretty good about that. And finally, the longest quest I have experienced thus far. Enlightened Journey. For a bomber cap, bomber jacket, and what, three levels? Oof. Wow, that uh, that was really lucky. Ended up getting the two full sets of ham robes in um, probably under an hour. Not only did I get my first bonus XP star, but I got the two of them back to back. Oh yeah, one, one last thing for day four. Thought I should mention. I got... Uh, my first Twitch subscriber today, and I think the guy did it just to see what my subscriber notification looks like, but still, it, it means, like, so much to me. Also had my first bit donation today, I just, I love you guys. Alright, so I'm just gonna call this uh, day five now, um, but really, I just wanted to go ahead and start claiming the pineapples you can get from Karamja, so I finished the Karamja set, uh, the Easy Diaries. I'm going to throw the 1k XP up here, and then uh, if I go over to Del Monte, this is his name, then I can claim, let's see if it's a right click, yeah, claim 40 pineapples per day. Oh, and as you can tell, I totally picked up a Slayer task by accident. I still haven't done one, but I now have a task for 5 gelatinous abominations. Alright, so I'm doing a, a few quests out of order of the guide. Uh, so there's Ichthlarin's little helper. Ichthlarin's? Ichthlarin's? Uh, anyway, 
I uh, got the Amulet of Catspeak, uh, but really I'm just trying to get Smoking Kills done, which is what I'm about to start uh, once I get the items together. And that's because I uh, want to unlock the Daily Broad Arrowheads from shops. That's it. I, uh, I just need to be able to buy those. So I killed the Banshee Mistress, and then the Scarabs killed me after that. So I'm like stuck in a cutscene, but the game won't let me reclaim my stuff. I, I very much broke the game. Oh, am I gonna live? Did I continue progressing in the quest yeah just return to Simona and, <laughs> and Paul Nivnich okay so um this is really interesting like this is worthy of a bug report so I will do that but wow I just had a 99 point cash and I was like one to two seconds away from getting the hundredth point that is just the worst feeling <laughs> Oh, and it's not because I'm a noob or anything, it's because people were, like, four cressing at the same exact time, and, um, I ended up showing up late, so, yeah, being, like, two minutes late, and still getting 99 points is not bad. Alright, so you know I couldn't just sit around and not reach this milestone today, and I think this is actually the, uh, the first broadcast that I'll get, but catch one fish... And there it is. One K total level. Bam. It took me this long to complete Ernest the Chicken. And I'm only doing it so I can go on to Animal Magnetism. It feels super weird. And a uh, few observations from doing this for a few minutes. Uh, one is I hate myself. Uh, two is I'm not quite getting the like 40 or 50,000 XP an hour uh, that I expect. Uh, it's still about 30 to 31k. Um, but yeah, like I said, I hate myself. So luckily I only have to do this to 52. And then uh, really the plan is then uh, wildly agility course. So I will hate myself less so long as I don't get PK'd for my demonic skull. Because I can only afford one. Uh, so yeah, basically I'll just keep a friends list open and hope that I can quick hop in time. Hey, there's, uh, 175 quest points. And a Rag and Bone Man that's, like, perfectly themed for the upcoming Halloween. Turns out I need a COD for Freeing Pirate Pete. And that's also my daily from a few days ago, so... I guess I'll actually do this daily instead of just ignore it and hope it doesn't exist. There's Spirits of the Elid, and 43 Prayer. That uh, Perfect from Melee is pretty good. Alright, so now it's confirmed that I'm no longer a noob. Got Dragon Slayer done. Let's pop these lamps. Nice, 44 Death, 48 Strength. Alright, 50 Defense. Working on that uh, grind. I guess I just unequip the armor and it should upgrade itself. Yep. Nice. And there we go. 60 mage. Alright, well I claimed the magical dice by accident. Let's pop it. Boom. 500k. No, not drop coins. Okay. Gothic Smiter, huh? Alright, there's the end of the uh, first Reaper assignment. Three giant mole kills. New record on the last one. For some blood runes. I'll take it. 40 to 42 Slayer from uh, three giant moles. It's not bad. Let's go get some more giant moles to kill. Alright, this is a uh, pretty big one. Just hop out of cash, and yeah, 57 div, that's a big level, right? Nah, 1100 total. I couldn't just uh, sit where I was before, man. I had to pick up a little bit of rune crafting, doing a little bit of AFK stuff, really. Uh, so yeah, there's uh, rune crafting in a rune span, 20 to 33, and uh, up to 48 fishing. 
I'm trying to get to 52 so I can start doing Minifos. Um, yeah, that's about it. Tomorrow will be a long day, though. I'm at 1120 total right now, and the goal probably won't happen, but the goal is 1250 total and maybe even 250 quest points. If I get one or the other, I'm happy, but that would be the goals. Oh, and just to be clear, from now on, I think I'm going to start using that level overlay as a, uh, just a marker for where I started for the day. Uh, back whenever I was doing my original Road to Comp series, it was pretty difficult to keep it updated with every single level, and a lot of the time it would fall behind, forget to do it one day. Um, yeah, it's a lot easier to remember just to do it once a day at the beginning of the day, and see where I end up. Uh, also, sorry if I keep stuff like this on screen, it's, it's... It's for my stream, but, uh, yeah, I tend to forget to, to close the captures, so if they're there, they're there. Uh, if they're not, then, you know, I'm being cognizant of that. Alright, Monkey Madness complete. Boom, yeah, 110k. What was that? Two health levels, two strength levels, four attack, and three defense. Like that. All right, that puts me at uh, 200 quest points. And combat lamp and a summoning from 10 to 28. Yeah, it's a good chunk of levels. All right, there's the last T2 dice. 500k and an H2 shield. All right, Barok easy tasks taken care of. Need to mine faster. Alright, this is a, a pretty big unlock for the account. Miscellanea done. Let's go ahead and manage it. Go ahead and deposit, uh, what, like 1040k? Yep. And not herbs. Let's do straight wood for one. Okay, straight wood for now. Let's go do uh, Royal Trouble before reset hits. It'll happen eventually. There we go. Boom. Royal Trouble done, so I got the extra five workers. I uh, got a Slayer level, I think. Yep. 44 Slayer. Still haven't done a task. Let's manage and uh, put this into... I think I wanted hardwood. Yeah. Alright, this is the first big upgrade. Animals can now breed in small pins. Boom. That should uh, give a lot of bunnies. Like a whole lot of bunnies. And... There we go. Chosen Commander. Big levels. Most important of which is uh, 1200 total milestone. Some nice fireworks. And, uh, yeah. 53 strength, 51 agility. I've only got like 10k left to do with the uh, clockwork things. And 50 thieving. Alright guys, we're finally there to the end of the first week. End of day 7, you see? Started at 1120 total and 193 quest points. The goal was 1250 total, or 250 quest points. And man, that 250 quest points goal was pretty lofty. But uh, this is where we ended up. 1240, so real close to 1250, at 217 quest points. Today was a pretty productive day, and uh, ended up knocking out quite a bit of crafting there at the end. Up to 49, which means 49 can do Tears of Guthics. I might actually need 49 smithing as well, but I'm right there at it. And uh, yeah, knock out Tears of Guthics, go run that for the first time, and I'll end up at like 37 or 38 summoning. So I'm basically there. All right, that's what week one looks like. 128 quests complete, 105 not started, and two in progress. That's a recipe for disaster and dimension of disaster. Right here, already rank at, well, I'm not actually ranked 625k. That's on the Mainscape leaderboards. I'm in the top 20,000 or so on the Iron Man leaderboards, which is quite a bit. I knocked out 2.7 mil total XP, 1240 total, of course. Through all the levels and three days, ten hours, or the last seven days. Like I said, 
I've been doing a whole lot of work, a uh, whole lot of streaming. Got a 17-hour stream, a 16-hour stream, and I think a 13-hour stream all in. So, yeah, expect some more of those, though. Maybe not quite as many hours. I literally have a class starting tomorrow, uh, at the day after this, this video goes up. Um, so my semester is about to get a little worse, and yeah, we'll see what happens. But that's where I'm at. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope to see you in the streams, and uh, see you next week.